Hey, I want to do a, just a quick how-to video um, for nebulizing ozonated glycerin. Um, <clears throat> my name's John. I have um, a sarcoma cancer that's in my lung, and I am experimenting with ozonated glycerin uh, to see if it has any effect on it. So I can show you real quick what I did. Uh, basically, I have I've got two syringes. They're both 10 mil, milliliters. Um, so I put, I've got one labeled with a G, one labeled with a W, glycerin and water. And basically in the glycerin one, you want to pull up between like two and three milliliters down in this area, and then eight milliliters of um, distilled water. You take that, and I put it into this little shot glass here, and kind of swirled it around for a couple minutes. Um, it took a while to get the glycerin and the water to mix together. It didn't seem like the glycerin wanted to uh, wanted to blend with the water very well, but just maybe like two or three minutes swishing it around. I didn't want to really put anything in there and stir it. I just wanted to, to have it in the glass. Take that and dump it into the nebulizer. So now the, the liquid is in there. Um, there's a little mark on the side as far as like how much medicine, quote unquote, to put in there. Um, this is just like a standard nebulizer. So you take that and screw it on to the, to the face mask, connect the hose, and then this goes to the nebulizer. This is a, a pump nebulizer. I got off Amazon, it's maybe 50 bucks. Um, you want the pump compared to the mesh, like the pump's going to do a better job of atomizing um, the glycerin. And here's here's a shot of the box. And that's it. You just, uh, just hit the power button and you'll see it start to atomize it and then start to breathe. Breathe in and out. Um, this treatment, uh, till it's all gone, that little bit in there lasts like 10 to 12 minutes. Um, and that's it. Best of luck.